Hello fellow YouTubers, this is Lewis the Indispensable here, and welcome back to the Sigil. This is the E5M8, Halls of Perdition, final map of Sigil. Let's do this, let's finish this door. Yep, this is quite normal with Sigil, these lost souls who approach need to kill them, but they just force to kill them. Do it, it's coming, it's gonna take a while, but make it easier later on. Huh? That's new, the Cyberdeam was awake over. That's actually not good. I mean, it's part of the thin fight anyway, the Spider Demon. I mean, oh, spoilers. I'm sorry for the mile off of this. Why? My souls don't want to cooperate as usual. That four shotgun shells, but you should take about one or two. We can now use this. No, kill at least two. Ow! There's only 55 enemies in this map, but you don't get much ammo when the enemies that you face are actually pretty tanky. So, grateful. I'm gonna die. This early. Probably. Maybe. Who knows? Right. Soul can charge. Go. Give me a hair cut. Peace. I've got a mauling about. Alright. Oh. Just threw that piece of paper at me. Oh, that's on the. Oh, okay, that was the worst BFG shot in the history of BFG shots. Find a BFG shot at a Baron, and he didn't die. Hello, artificial difficulty, man. Finishing this game easy. Okay, then shot for you. Oh, killed by you. Oh, you. Oh, you. Alright. It's a hit. Put out this spectre. Oh, don't fall off. That's also an option, too. Now, do you guys want to see a magic trick? It activates this time. Oh, the BFG really does not work. Magic, here you go. Grab a back seat and just watch. All dead. It's our first secret. I'm gonna backtrack to uh, 
here. This is opened up, our second secret, and it's our third secret. Got one more, but that's in the final area. So let's see how bad this goes. Let's see how much of a bloody disaster this is. Oh dear, the cyber demon is awake. Let's see. Oh! Can't one shot the spider demon for some reason. Here we go. Yay. I guess the idea was to make him in fight, but they don't cooperate with me, so I just kill them both. Now we're in the final stretch of this map, that actually went. Perfectly, I'll be honest. We're rockets now. This, see this little gap in the fence? It's your final secret. But that deck. Are we done? We're done with sigil, let's just go. Okay, that's all of perdition. Pretty good final map, honestly. I mean, Compared to all the other maps, this is actually quite an easy last stage. It's not as easy as um, E1M8. I mean, that's pathetic, that map, in terms of difficulty. Right, let's go read the ending. Baphomet was only doing Satan's bidding by bringing you back to hell. Somehow they didn't understand that you're the reason they failed at the first time. After mopping up the place we are arsenal, you're ready to face the more advanced demons that were sent to Earth. Lock and load. Rip and tear. And that's it. I think there's supposed to be a monster shooty thing here, but... Oh no. Like in uh, the original. I guess that's the, the, the Baphomet face and now it's... I don't remember this ending. That's a goat. One of skeleton and some deer thing. Don't know. <coughs> <coughs> well, that's sigil anyway. That's sigil. Um, Alright. Half of it was good, half of it was a bit crap. And ridiculously unfair. Uh, got released by Jorimo in 2018, maybe it's not. Maybe it's kind of out of practice, I mean. No, the thing with John Romero is that he, he designed those maps t t to annoy himself. And it annoyed everyone else in the process. And the music doesn't loop, okay, that's weird. Yeah, I mean. It's really hard, I mean, some maps are unf unfairly hard, some maps are hard because they're legitimately hard. And, well, this is the end of Sigil, really, nothing really much to say about it. Next we'll do Doom 2, which will be tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow. And then it'll be Doom 2, No Rest for Living, TNT Evolution and Plutonia Experiment. <coughs> then we'll play the new stuff and probably play some other game in between. So this is Lewis the Indispensable signing out. Goodbye.